How people call out to God. And you might say, or somebody might, might say, or I would say sometimes, I'm just, I, it just, the thought came into my head and then out of nowhere this person appeared right in front of me, although before it was just a thought in my head, my mind. Or I imagined it and I wished it was so and it became that. But I performed in some way, I did something on purpose, a ritual of some kind, I behaved according to a set of rules, a book, and then I got what I wished for, what I wanted. And here's how people talk to God, and they see something out there beyond themselves. But I say, a higher power is anything that's above you and your ability. So if you said, or if I said, and you may think about this differently than I do, but I mean this, if I say, I'm going to the highest power, or I'm trusting in the highest power, what I mean to say is, I'm going to God. But when I say, I'm going to a higher power, I'm going to trust in a higher power, uh, as I understand that power, what I mean is, anything that is going to help me that I'm not able to do on my own, and that is the hi a higher power. And sometimes that means I got to go to a bank and get a loan, and other times that might mean I need to ask a friend for a ride, so on and so forth. But I use the means I have uh, with the access that I'm provided by the systems that I'm a part of, according to the rules that I live under, and so on and so forth. And this would have to do then with also, under certain systems, possibly voting and uh, challenges of uh, a democratic system, uh, so-called if there is actually such a thing. But nonetheless, mankind is searching for God. And what does that mean? How does that look? Well, one thing it means is that people are always going to be asking a question, and that is why or how or to what end or purpose. And that's the question people ask. And what does that look like? It can look like a lot of things, comic books, movies. It's art. And it's expressed in many stories in many ways. But the stories that we have, the tales that we tell, are according to our interpretations and our cultures and the times in which we were born. So, looking at these things, including the Bible, especially Star Wars, we're asking, how do people communicate with God? And what does that mean when we communicate with each other? And is that in some way the same thing? And so we're looking at these questions uh, again, we're using the Bible, and we're using Star Wars. And if it turns out to be nothing other than a really good time, so be it. But who knows, we may find at the end of the tunnel that your focus really does determine your reality. Well, friends, that's all the time we have for today. Remember, friends, as we've already said, but we're repeating it, your focus determines your reality. And may the Force be with us.